In order to take full advantage of the videos you create, you have to lead viewers to the next step after they finish watching your videos. Video marketing can be very easy if you know what you're doing. Adding in clickable links to your videos can easily bring in more views to your other videos or money making videos. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add clickable links to your channel videos and we are starting right now. Hi, I'm Winston, the Solopreneur Warrior, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to add clickable links not only to your YouTube videos, but also to the videos you post on Facebook and Instagram for more views. But before we get into all that, I would like to know in the comments area below this video if you have been adding clickable links to your YouTube video or other channel videos. And if you have been doing so, have you been taking full advantage of all the linking methods? Now, if this is your first time to this channel, channel and you're interested in hacks and tools to grow your video marketing then you might want to consider hitting that subscribe button and let's get started so why should you even think about adding links to your videos why is it even important most often the links in videos tend to serve only one purpose turning viewers into subscribers or leads on YouTube, you can easily link from within any video to another video. You can also link to your website or any other product page you run. Let's now start looking at the different ways some social platforms allow you to lead views from your video to a targeted page. And we are going to start off with YouTube. So how do you add clickable links to your YouTube videos? In an effort to help video creators convert people and lead them to their desired page, YouTube provides video creators with two options. The first is of course the most common way, which is adding links in your video description. In the description area of the video, simply add the full URL of the landing page you want your viewers watching the video to visit. Unfortunately, on YouTube, you can't hyperlink a specific keyword or use an anchor text on YouTube. You also want to keep in mind that you have to add the HTTPS colon double slash before the URL in order to make it a clickable link. If you think the URL you want to add is too long, you can also use use a URL shortener, a simple tool like Bitly will help shorten the link for you. Adding links within the video like cards or end screen is the second option. Cards are these non-intrusive clickable links that pops up on the corner of your video when added and when clicked on it, it will show additional info that explain the purpose of the link. Cards can easily be used to link to other websites, affiliate offers, stores, or other videos. End screen links, on the other hand, appear in the last 10 to 20 seconds of your video and can link to other videos to easily allow viewers to subscribe to your channel. To be able to add all these in video links, follow these steps. Simply click to edit the video you want to add the links to, and then on the options above, select cards. When you click on the Add Cards button, it will show you the different type of cards. Just click on the Create button on the one you want to use. You have to accept the terms and conditions by selecting Enable if you haven't done so already. You can enter here the link you want to send the viewers watching your videos to. You also have the option to add a teaser text which is just about 30 characters, a call to action to the link that you just added. There is also a timeline below the video where you can adjust the start time of the cut you want to add. Now, if you want to edit the cut at any time, you can simply go back to the cuts tab and click on the edit button. You also want to keep in mind that YouTube only lets you insert external links, links from web pages outside of YouTube, only if you are a part of their YouTube partner program. To be able for your external website to have access to your YouTube channel, you also need to install a code on your website so YouTube can quickly identify your site every time you add it within your videos as a card or end screen. Now let's look at how to add a link to a Facebook video. If you have watched my video on how to get views from Facebook, you will know by now how to link from your Facebook videos to your YouTube videos. 
Currently, there are just two ways to add links to your Facebook videos. You can easily link in the caption area of your Facebook video, similar to how the links in your video description on YouTube works. So, you can insert your links in the caption area of your Facebook video post. In the same video I just mentioned on how to get views from Facebook, I also showed you another way of linking in the comment section of groups after making a post with the video thumbnail as the image you want to share. Usually, visually pleasing graphics can further encourage people to click and watch your video. Just make sure to check out that video together with the other videos in the playlist on how to get more views to your videos. Now the last is adding links to an Instagram video. On Instagram, things are a little bit different. You can easily redirect followers from your story to a landing page of your choice with just the cool swipe up feature. However, there is a catch. To get free access to the swipe up feature, you must have a business account and at least 10,000 followers. If you happen to have less than 10,000 followers, you have to opt into Instagram ads, which is not exactly free. And that will give you the option of adding links using both the swipe of future for story ads and call to action buttons for feed ads. Here is also a playlist on how to add links to Instagram story without being verified or without having 10,000 followers. Now, I will assume that you already probably know that videos are becoming the current norms. It's no longer an option, but a necessity to start linking within your videos. Again, let me know in the comments area below this video if you have been linking within your videos or not. I hope this was another helpful video. If so, hit the like button below, share on your preferred social site and don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss another helpful video.